the thing that surprised me about when I became a Much Music DJ was it's a lot more work than you think it actually is. Uh, sometimes I speak to my dad, and he'll just be kind of like, what do you do all day? Because I think a lot of people uh, just see the, the TV part, and then they just think we sit around all day, which is just, uh, not the case. It's a lot of work, it's a lot of research, but it's also it's a lot of fun. It's a great job. When I started, um, as most people do on Much, I had no television experience at all. Zero. None. Uh, I felt completely uncomfortable in front of a camera. Um, I knew that I loved music and pop culture, um, and I loved, you know, the idea of interviewing people. The other problem is I wasn't very good at it. So it takes a lot. It's like anything. You have to work hard at it, and, and um, perseverance is a key. And eventually I got to a point where I felt really comfortable, and then from there you feel comfortable being in you know, different situations, and you just become better at your craft. And it, it is a craft, so you have to work really hard at it. But it's very rewarding once you feel like you are there. I don't watch myself on TV, and I, if you're going to become our next Bunch of Music BJ, I suggest you do not uh, watch yourself on TV. Follow my lead, and uh, I don't know, to describe to people how watching yourself on TV feels, it's kind of like the feeling you get when you hear your voice on a, a message that you've left. Um, you know, you're kind of like, oh, do I sound like that? Is that really what I, you know? But it's, um, don't watch yourself on TV. <laughs> I've learned a lot of things that I didn't know that I could do before. You know, I've done a lot of live shows. I've never done anything like that before. I think I've just learned that if you really work hard, um, because for me, I've had to work really hard uh, to get to the point where I am. And if you work really hard, you can do it. And you can get better. Uh, and you can be great at what you do. I think that when you're in high school, you can your teachers and your parents tell you hard work will pay off and you, know, you can do whatever you want to do. I, I think for me anyway, I kind of digest that as, yeah, whatever, shut up. I want to go play video games or go out and play with my friends. You know, really, it doesn't really sink in for me. But if you actually do that, you know, I had zero experience. Now I'm, you know, I'm five years into a job. It's, it's great and I feel like I do really great work and it's exciting. So, I mean, if you work hard at something, you can do whatever you want. That's kind of what I've learned. Pros are, well, the fact that you get to, you know, talk to great people, uh, you get to interact with uh, a lot of interesting people, not only in front of the camera, but behind the camera as well. Uh, you get to travel, you get to see and be places you would never otherwise be. Uh, it's a great gig. It's very exciting. The cons are that... Um, I think the con for me when I first started was I'd moved from Montreal, so my life completely changed. I didn't see my friends and family as much as I used to, but I don't know. The cons are few and far between. It's a pretty good job. I really can't complain. It is pretty good. Mm -hmm.